Alright guys, welcome. Uh, this game is called Going Under. We're gonna review it and work through it at the same time. Okay, I played this game a little bit before and I think it's a nice game. So I wanted to show it to you. And well, if you ask me, I'll say it's a yes, you should probably buy it and play it. It's definitely fun. But let's let's just have a look. Okay. So you play this girl, right? I mean she's just starting up at a new job and then she's gonna <laughs> it's funny because the way they set it up is you know you come in and join as a marketing uh, person and ultimately you end up doing fighting monsters <laughs> let's just have a look so she's already seen the intro video the intro to the company so skip all of that she's excited about the job but there are monsters in the basement or something, and then she's like, "What?" <laughs> so the monsters are escaping the basement, and uh, her job is to kill the monsters. And she's shocked. She's like, "That's not what I signed up for." It's very funny. So we skip all of that. So she's kind of out to look around. Mm, I think. We have to end up somewhere, if I recall. Right in there. Is it? No. Okay, you can you see you've got those three slots on the top left corner. You can pick up stuff. You can stash. You can fight with all kinds of equipment. You can fight with a laptop, with a screen, the laptop here. I mean, you can fight with a pretty big rubik cube. <laughs> That's funny. I want to choose the laptop. Notice how you move slower because the laptop, well, the screen is pretty heavy. So, what are we going to use to fight? Uh, let's, 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 let's go with that laptop. I just find the, no, I just have to find the entrance to the, the basement. Where are those? Oh, there's the monster. Oh, okay, we're not in the basement yet. So, how do I kill a monster? So I grab and attack. Let's do that. There you go. I can punch, but I think you're far more effective if you use tools around you. Come here. Okay, let's go find something else. Okay, no, I do have some equipment with me that I can use. Ouch! Yeah. That's your job. <laughs> Among other things, that's gonna be your job. See? That was easy. <laughs> So now you have to go to the basement. <laughs> he doesn't want to. That's funny. Okay, we just have to skip all of that and go do our job. I'd love to. Let's go kill some monsters. I mean, who wants a boring desk job when you can kill some monsters? <laughs> Joblin. All right, here we are. Okay, you can pick up that. No, I want something more powerful. Okay, that's fine. Let's see, so three. I think that's the damage. It level to lock. Okay, L two. Lock on you and take that. Ouch. Ouch. What happened? 
Okay. How do I have? Oh, where's my sword? Yeah, there it is. I can pick up chairs. You can fight with everything around you. Well, not everything, but most things. You also want to be selective on what you choose. Some you can keep. Although after a while, you kind of break them. See, for this, for instance, this bar tool. If you hit it a few times, it'll break. So I usually pick up things that I can that don't break. That way, I can use it when I fight. Okay, let's practice dodging. Ouch! Oh, come on. Ouch! Like I'm about to die. Okay, now you die. Okay. What's up? Why, why is it flashing? Okay, let's get another bone. So as you can see, it's a nice game. I mean, it's... I like it, actually. It's... I think over time, you get to upgrade. You get new skills. You learn new skills, you pick up skills, you get stronger progressively, and you need to get stronger because you get stuff as you go along. Okay, swap between items L1 and R1. Okay, I did that, so I know it's kind of, it's kind of like a tutorial right, right now. Okay, I know how to, to lock. Onto my enemy. Catch me if you can. Okay. Let's be brave and nail them. And as you can see, some items are quicker to hit with. So, you decide how you want to fight. Oh, you can throw things as well. Yeah. And the art. Oh, I'm on fire. I died. How did I, get, uh, how did I catch fire? But anyway, okay, it's, it's a review, so I just wanted to show you what the game looks like. I am a fan of it. I play it every now and then. And I've got so many games, so don't always have time to come back to a particular game. But this one is, is one of those, which is quite nice. So mm, my review on it, it's a great game. It's a fun game for all ages. So you should definitely buy it. And uh, that's it.